Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about element number 115, Moscovium. Moscovium is named after Moscow, the capital of Russia. Only about 30 atoms of element number 115 have been made, but they are enough to help dispel one of the more colorful myths about this element. For some time, people who believe in UFOs and the like have claimed that there are stable isotopes of element 115 and that these power the anti-gravity drives used in certain models of UFO. The two main problems with this are that A, there quite plainly aren't any stable isotopes of Moscovium. If there were, no one would be bothering to study 30 atoms of various intensity unstable isotopes and B, even if there were, there's no basis for thinking they would be any more helpful in constructing an anti-gravity drive than our boron or gadolinium. So while it's fun to speculate about UFOs, and there's certainly no good reason for denying that they could and perhaps do exist, Moscovium has got nothing to do with UFOs and it remains as sadly unimportant as the rest of the elements up there in the hundreds. Here we have Moscow's coat of arms. The Moscovium is an artificially produced transuranium element of atomic number 115. In 2010, scientists at the Joint Institute for Nuclear Research in Dubna, Russia, and at the Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory in Berkeley, California, US, announced the production of four atoms of Moscovium when calcium-48 was fused with americium-243. Two isotopes of Moscovium were produced with atomic weights of 287 and 288. These isotopes decayed in 46.6 and 19 to 280 milliseconds, respectively. Its chemical properties may be similar to those of bismuth. If you're interested in learning about the element bismuth, I'll leave a link in the description below so you can go ahead and check out that video. In January 2016, the discovery of Moscovium was recognized by the Internal Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry, or IUPAC, and the International Union of Pure and Applied Physics, IUPAP. The discovery named it Moscovium after the Moscow Oblast, where the Joint Institute for Nuclear Research is located. The name Moscovium was approved by IUPAC in November of 2016. So again, a quick reminder, Moscovium is highly radioactive and has no known biological or industrial use beyond that of research. Both isotopes of Moscovium have been shown to produce nihonium, daughter nuclei, after undergoing alpha decay. So that was Moscovium explained in X Minutes or Less. If you liked this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Other than that, thank you everyone for watching. Have a great one.